damn, man. This Quincy Black is everybody, man, and we out the push, man. We been out the push. We really will caught the street. You know man. what I'm talking about? Pink, for real. You know what I'm saying? All right, so we got Ebody and Quincy Black jumping off the porch with us today. Welcome, guys. Nah, we're, what's going down? Happy man. to be here, man. Yes, sir. Nah, I appreciate y'all coming all the way out from Texas nah, to come yeah, mess with us, man. Had to get it done. Yeah, yeah so. man. So first off, how we feel, man? How, man, know? we cool, man. We touched down last night, had a bullshit ass plane delay, but you know, oh, shit. made it happen, touched down and made some things shake. So Okay. You know, yeah, we here. Yes, sir, man. Do you guys come out to Atlanta often or not too much? Uh sometimes. We got a couple people out here, so you know we bump back and forth. Okay. Yeah, okay. been a minute for me. In the cracks, though. We were in the trenches, we don't too much. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, I dig that. Me, man. Nah, for sure. Yeah, yeah. Man, go ahead and introduce your boys to back there oh, yeah, today, too, yeah. man. Oh, yeah, this is my boy, Roy Show, man. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Uh, Diddy. Yes, sir, man. Yes, so, what so, so, what do you guys got planned while you're in the city? You in and out with it? You out here networking? Oh, or what, what we doing? doing a little network, you know. I'm um, trying to push up on these niggas' hoes, man. <laughs> I got him by here. Man. 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 Savage mode, huh? Yeah, man. I'm out here shopping. <laughs> nah, we <laughs> out here chilling, man, trying to, you know, see what we can get into. Yeah. Lock in who lock in with us type shit. For sure, yeah. man. All right. So both of y'all from Beaumont? Yeah. yeah for sure. Okay, man. So not that many people from Beaumont made it to only steps, man. So yeah. <laughs> I need y'all to break down the culture, man. Talk about like the way of life out there, man. I ain't yeah. gonna lie, Beaumont. Straight thug. It's, it's, it's a small it's, city, you gotta be thugging. Yeah. A little over 100,000 population, yeah. you know what I'm saying? It's one big ass hood. Really? It got one good part, you know what I'm saying? And people don't really too much go that way unless they down there kicking the door in or they done moved <laughs> out the hood type shit, you feel me? So it's like. We from that Pal Archer, though, you know what I'm saying? Okay. So it's like. Southside shit. Whole lot. Every other city, you know what I'm saying? Every every city got a hood in that motherfucker. We just happen to be one of the slimy, just like. <laughs> yeah, so it's like, she. Tell them Google it, man. They like, like the Google shit. shit, man. Google and see what's going on out like there, man. Yeah, you better if you come out there, tap in. But it's a good place, though. I ain't gonna lie. I, I settled. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't even move from out there, like. For real? Yeah. You, you there for the long yeah, haul, then? How long redo that? I'll redo that. I'll redo that. I'll redo that. He's saying that because he he from there. Yeah. yeah. People don't be it's like, move about that, man. I wouldn't retire. Like when I retire from everything, mm -hmm. I'm coming back to the crib for sure. Okay. Okay. When I retire from everything, I'll come back to the crib for sure. Yeah. Now, do you guys feel like the city's changed much since you guys were younger up until today? Or is it? Oh yeah. It's oh like yeah. It's, it's, it's like the wild wild west right yeah, now. Yeah. Yeah. You um, gotta be. It's, it's like shit. Oh, yeah, have your saying. ages down to put your ass up, man. So. You know, you gotta stand your toes. So I ain't shit back in the day, really. You know, yeah. everybody. But they doing <laughs> it. So he love it. <laughs> they slanging iron, man. I was nah, trying to dude. tell you. Man, look at, we was doing a lot of shit. We was scratching, beating niggas up. And we was slanging a little iron. They slanging iron off the rip these days. So you could. Man, that's just the new generation. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, so you yeah. gotta be ready to slang yeah, some iron, man. What's up? You ain't slanging like Get all the way up out the damn way. Bro. Just get out like the way. The That's the, the best way. way. You, know, you know what I'm saying? If it, you ain't tied to the street, get out the way, man. Nah, mm. that's real. For real. Yeah. Cause you ain't gonna know what's going on, who doing what, how they coming. And they coming like that. Yeah. For real. So, yeah. I, so how long have you two been knowing each other? Did you guys grow up together? Or is... Yeah, we grew up together. Yeah. Okay. It's my dog, like, some real puppy. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So it's like, yeah, this ain't nothing new shit. Yeah, for shit, so. Yeah. for a minute. We started this rap shit, this rap journey together. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah for, for sure. Like in a group together or just? Yeah, for sure. Okay. Yeah. Like just a, a, a gang of niggas just rapping, getting high, you know what I'm saying? Trying to see who coming the hard. You know what I mean? Yeah. Shit started doing something. Niggas okay. stayed down with it. Still like, down with it. I ain't gonna lie, we, we really was playing with the shit. It's just like, when we start dropping like little freestyles, mm -hmm. it's like the city down there made it. Like, nah, y'all niggas gotta rap. Yeah, like, sure. Especially the hood, the hood was like, nah, y'all niggas gotta rap. Like, uh. fuck out of that. So it went from, all right, fuck it. You like the first niggas that really just- It was fun. Made rapping cool out there. Like, 
It wasn't no niggas wasn't rapping like that before. Probably three older niggas and they wasn't doing too much. But we them niggas that made like the whole city wanna do that shit. Look, that shit look cool. Okay. Yeah. Shit show. That's facts. Yeah. Yeah, we was out there doing it big, you know what I'm saying? Really opening doors and not even knowing. Hmm. Cause we ain't had no managers or nothing that shit, nobody in the, in the rap gang that shit. We just doing this shit. Yeah, we were wet behind the ear. We was just going in the studio, dropping shit. They hug a hard head, yeah, they hug a hard bit. They do a little. You <laughs> feel me? Like we wasn't Not even, really we wasn't seeing record. past the city. Yeah. Cause yeah. we were so turnt in the city. It's like, we yeah. wasn't even seeing past that shit until like. Niggas start opening up for Drake and all kinds of shit. This about seven years ago. Like, yeah. Shit. That's major. Yeah. Right there. Locking in with his big major Houston artists and shit. Yeah. Like J Dog, B King, all kind of people, man. We just started doing shit and made that shit look cool and everybody want to get on that shit. Because at a point in time, Beaumont was just consumers. So it was just people listening to people's music. Mostly Houston, Louisiana. Mm -hmm. So we had to turn up and we was a nigga that turned the city up. I ain't gonna lie. Okay. Yeah. Shit, so what's sure. your guys' thoughts on the music scene out there right now today, then? Man, that right now it's fire. It's loud in the motherfucker. We got Tizo coming up out there, bitch, doing mm -hmm. this shit. Yeah, for we shit, got sure. Big J coming up out there, motherfucker, doing her shit. For shit, sure. You got us coming, you feel me? We just like the ice is on top of you, feel me? Yeah, so it's yeah. like everything cool. The young niggas, they going hard. Like everybody see that it's a way. Like, niggas can do it for real. Oh, yeah. Yeah, for sure. Like, seeing the Jade and the T's all come from out there, motherfucker, and do it. Mm -hmm. Niggas like, oh, shit, real. that shit right it's up possible. the street. Yeah, yeah it's right yeah. up the street for real. We just got to gas up and get the, yeah. you feel me? Yeah, for real. Shout out to Jade and the T's up and shit, show. Yeah. Now, do you feel like there's a lot of unity in the city amongst the other artists, or is it pretty much just everyone doing their own thing? I ain't gonna lie, like, on the outside looking in, you gonna say everybody behind each other, but Right now, everybody kind of focus on themselves. Like, we support each other when we can, but niggas know it's like, can't yeah. nobody really put you on, bro. Yeah. So it's like, you got to do that shit yourself. Yeah, so you got to really put that work in the mind. You can't really man. look left and right when you smashing on that shit. You just got to straight forward, you feel me? So yeah. it's like. Yeah, everybody ain't got that Drake and little baby power to jump in your song <laughs> and, <laughs> and blow your ass up. From in the outside looking in, you're going to say, yeah, them niggas out so, yeah, like yeah. this. Yeah. Shit, so. Yeah. But we ain't yeah. letting no bullshit from the outside come no. in the city and do nothing. Stir yeah, so we nothing. Are, we tap no, in for shit, so. We ain't going for it, so. For so. What do you guys feel like it's going to take to, you know, make that next step for Beaumont then? I ain't gonna lie, them folks need to come tap in, man. Uh, yeah, I know, I think, I you know, know what once I get in that motherfucker fight, man, it. Since I just pull each other up, time. you know, I was yeah. for shit show. For shit show. I love some niggas I'm gonna fuck with if I make it for shit show. It's a lot of them, a couple of them doing their thing, little Nick and them and shit. I heard you know, it was we up got flip. Little flipper. Flipper harder than the motherfucker, he doing this thing, putting on like a motherfucker. Yeah. There's a couple people out there putting on, bro, it's just like, mm -hmm. That light, once that light really shine on the city, like I'm talking about really sit there for a little while. It's over with. We gonna have the same run Memphis having, BR had, we gonna have that run. They gonna know about it. Make it's sure you gonna tap in with the music, man. I'm saying yeah. niggas ain't fucking with us, for real. That on that level. Go check a nigga out, man. Nigga. Man, I'm telling you. Oh yeah, it's Southside. <laughs> Southside thing. I'm a Southside baby, you? for real. I ain't changing it. <laughs> same here, man. I'm gonna keep the same cut. Don't be in my casket with this hoe, you know what I'm saying? For real. Now that bitch one to one right there. Yeah. <laughs> like to turn here with this shit, but mate, they, they gotta check a nigga music out, man. <laughs> I gotta say, you gotta stretch that because people come yeah. see these interviews and go check a nigga out, nigga hard. For real, my brother hard, you know what I'm saying? Hell right yeah, niggas in Houston though. Yeah, they just waiting on us to do that know. one little move, you know. It's like, Houston family, it's I got time. some niggas out there that I fuck with in the age for shit, so. Yeah, so but, you just dropped that made with uh, my boy Young Al, too. Yeah, that bitch hard, that bitch doing numbers, did some crazy numbers, like the first couple of days, I was mm -hmm. like, yeah, these, these motherfuckers tapping in. Uh -huh. I got all kind of shit though coming, brother, that's just a, you <laughs> feel me? I'm telling you, it's gonna be real pressure, brother. Just tap in, stay tuned. Hey, man, all along. I just what did What's that movie thing you was in with you and XO? That's 33rd. Damn, he. 33rd soundtrack. I he did. You got a soundtrack on the movie with thing. DJ man, got shit going on. Okay. Mm -hmm. Man, I done had records. B-King. 
Fuck South Sauce, man. With man. Shit, sure. Free Sunshine. You feel me, that my boy? You <laughs> see, shit, real um, tough, yo. Nigga like, in the game, nigga just need to get that extra uh to that next level. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Once nigga stay in that algorithm. What's up? Yeah, nah, I feel that, man. Talk about this Go Gang, man. That's something we came up with okay. back in the day when we was doing a lot of um, a lot of Go shit, shit. Shit, shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We shit. really wasn't, I ain't see the full potential in ourselves at the time, so we was just out there running around on some Go shit, everything was a Go. Shit, shit, shit. You know what I'm saying? Like a motherfucker. <laughs> Sitting in the house, <laughs> 10, 15 deep, trying to see how the fuck we gonna scratch an M. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm shit. I'm going to the party, shut that bitch down. Yeah, it's crazy shit. Yeah, that's like it. Then it transpired to the music and shit. Niggas was like, yeah, it's a go for shit, show. Yeah, dropped that on Go song. We went and did that motherfucker. Yeah, that kind of went viral in the city. That just solidified it like, oh, okay, yeah, everything could go for yeah. shit, show. Yeah, go. can't reach that, man. I need to hop on that hoe, Stevie J, rapping that hoe in the club. It was yeah, crazy. Stevie J, yeah, it's hard right there. Yeah, yeah. Keati wanted to remix that bitch. It's going down. We just, we just didn't have nobody around us. We was like straight thugging. Yeah, we were just having fun. We were just. Well, you got a whole bunch of you niggas know what and saying? everybody in, in the and group. out the street. Let's go to the studio. 10, you 15, got 40 15, 20, niggas 20, around 20. and nobody do nothing but thug. And you got us rapping. Yeah, that's it. So I lay, they didn't have no advice for us. You know, so. in both money, it really ain't no. It's either you good in sports, mm -hmm. you got a mean hustle game with you, you know what I'm talking about? Or your ass want to lay something, still talk boots and go to that plant. Yeah, that's sure. the only option. You feel me? I ain't, I don't know no lawyers. You know what I'm saying? That I grew up with. Um, so it's like, I ain't never clocked in. It's like that bitch. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I swear to God, I'm going to get it. I ain't know how that shit look. Brother, I'll be out the lane. Ain't nothing wrong with 9 5 though. Ain't nothing wrong with it. I'm just saying, I'm out wrong the lane, ass man. nigga, man. <laughs> you just knew it wasn't for you. I just knew it wasn't for me, man. Uh, I just had to go get it. You know what I'm like, saying? The options so like, to break out that motherfucker on some rap shit, there's mm -hmm. like one in the mid. That's what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? Coming from where we come from, it's like, hell nah. It's like winning the lottery. Dude. You feel yeah. me? Like, how you do that? You feel me? So it's like, Pushing through that motherfucker a challenge, but I ain't shit. All right, once you set your mind to something, it's easy to attain if you just smash non-stop. I'm talking about a year. You get that motherfucker a hard year, you in the game. Yeah, you gonna see some progress. Yeah, yeah, you see you gotta, gotta, my mama, that shit gonna start making sense. yourself, man. That shit a big ass investment. Yeah. I feel like that's the Texas way, though, when it comes to this rap shit. Yeah. It's like the independence. Yeah, because yeah. we naturally hustlers. Like, we natural hustlers. Like, you can name, man, you can name a couple niggas from Houston that just made an M out for ripping and running through Texas. Oh, yeah. You, you feel me? The state. Then, then, you may yeah. hit Oklahoma or something. Yeah, yeah. Oh, look, I was scared, but mainly, like, nigga, they tearing Texas ass up. Yeah, because the fans, they like such Cause supporters they die hard of fans. Shit. Exactly. Yeah. So, yeah. so it's like, shit, your fan you had 10 years ago, still your motherfucking fan, still gonna pull up to their show, still gonna. So, yeah, for sure. Now, that's you real. just natural hustlers, but. You know, that shit only gets you so far. You got to yeah. connect the dots and everything. Yeah. So you got to bring the hustle shit with the ambition, the, the, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, trying to be the mega artist. I'm trying to be one of them big motherfuckers, you know. Where I go everywhere, where I can be in Paris, they see this patch and they know what's going on. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to get to, so we got to keep Man, smashing. I just can't wait till I'm 250 for a feature. I mean. I'll let it come with it. 250, you know 50. I need yeah. 250. I, when I do that, week, you good. come on, man. <laughs> yeah. Come on, man. It can be done. It's going to get done with you. got to keep on smashing. I you need that Drake here. Drizzy touch when I just fought with a nigga. He done turned up. I done turned his whole, yeah, yeah. This whole situation. thank me later, nigga. Persist out, but I need that kind of. Yeah, that's what I'm going for. Yeah, and we are, we should, we gonna pull Texas up. I feel like it'll be and you know, niggas we, like us for shit, like pull them up, up like, cause it ain't no we don't, we, we the type of niggas, man. That shit, seeing another nigga win don't affect us. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Cause we know what we got going on. We know how we coming. So seeing you win ain't we smiling for you. Keep going, man. But just make sure you do the same thing when you see us coming. Nah, that's real. real. 
Cause we coming. As they can see, we out the push with this shit. And you know, we right up the street from Pimp C, so you know, we cut from mm -hmm. that cloth, so you gonna get that raw, real. Like, it ain't gonna be, the label made me do this, the label, nah, we not going for it. We not going for it. We cut from that Pimp C cloth for shit, so. So it's like, yeah, they gonna love us once the world see it. Like, when they click on this, they gonna tap in. You know I was saying? Saying I'm saying, I'm fucking about my niggas. I'm about my niggas on some other shit. Some player shit, you feel me? Get money. We be doing big shit on accident. Yeah, this is our second interview with my child. Our first one was Say Cheese. So, like, we don't do no smile shit. We gotta keep going. I'm trying to take, keep, keep going. We look up. We gonna be there, man. It's coming. Yeah. Eat by the Quincy Black. You know what I'm saying? The power at your bottom line. That's outside. For shit show. What's the meaning behind E-Body? Or how'd you get that name? Man, I just always been the littlest nigga in the clique. Like, you feel me? So everybody did E-Body. All my niggas just started calling me E-Body. Then when we were starting this rap shit, I was like, damn. Everybody just called me E. I need something else, you feel yeah, me? I need e something else, you feel you know? yeah. me? So I said, hey, fuck it, I'm gonna run with that. E-Body. Yeah. Right, you know, yeah. E-Body, AKA Easter Pink, man. Yeah. That's my new alias right now, you feel me? That's self-explanatory? Yeah, that's self-explanatory, okay. man. If you know, you know, you feel me? If you don't, you gonna find out. Yeah. Easter Pink, you Definitely feel me? Definitely for shit, sure. But you know. No K roll in the cup. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What happened between you and uh, Trill Sammy? I mean, that, uh, that Trill Sammy shit, what it? Brother be able to tell you more about it, cause brother was frontline. I was right there laughing the whole time. Brother was, you know, man, was really brother going was out to it out. I ain't gonna even put the little engineers and shit, they names out, they got a little names and shit. <coughs> they was being messy, hitting me up. Like every nigga that was saying this ghost shit, I was pressing him. And he happened to be one of them that, and, and I pressed him and they recorded it, the video went viral. Then they booked, they booked us a show together. Some shit is how I ended up I was on the internet rant that one moment. I was going off on everybody. Nigga, I had gotten to it a couple of niggas. <laughs> All the way to go, yo, yo. Me and him on the phone all day. Like, so it's like shit. Yeah, they booked me. They gonna pop his shit on my mama. They he ain't book, let nothing. I wouldn't let nothing home. slide, you know what I'm saying? Be, I be having to tell him, like, Bro, I had down, to learn from that, though. You know, I had, because I would look, see. <laughs> you know, when you first into the rap, yeah, game, I, it, 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 I see you got to realize it's a little different. Than I the see they about protecting the brand. Yeah. And I'm looking like, damn, they fucking with the brand, they ain't fucking with us. I got to let them know what's going on. So I started pressing niggas. And people, you know how they is, the promoters end up booking him and, and booked us at the same show. So when we walked in, they wanted to see, they really wanted to see this nigga like that. I was going to do that regardless. You know what I'm saying? I gotta go see what's going on, but that shit was a, it wasn't no smoke like I thought that it was. That shit really wasn't, they really made it bigger than what it was. That yeah. shit really wasn't on shit, like, at all. There ain't no smoke unless somebody gets smoked, really you know, So real. that was the end of it right then and there? Oh yeah, yeah you know, okay. niggas, man. Niggas, I got some calls and shit. Niggas was trying to see what's up, but they weren't trying to see what's up on some gangsta shit. They were trying to call some shit down, like. Even I had Kiati mad at me. I'ma say it on here. He was mad at me. <laughs> the radio host from 97.9 in Houston. Man, Stanley, stop fucking with me. He fuck with E though. You gotta lock back in, Kiati. I don't know what you on, bro. I'm still a same nigga. I was pussy. He wasn't nothing. But they was trying to make it like I'm a bully, so I had to just calm down, like, and, and really bully, peep the homie. game. You know what I'm saying? Like, okay, bully, this rap shit and different. Like, you, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> the rap shit really, you gotta just know how to smile and just stay out of nigga way. If they come playing, you play them, but yeah. it's so many niggas be knowing each other, buddy, buddy ass niggas. A lot and of shit. politics in this shit. A lot of politics yeah, yeah, in this shit. Yeah, black by you for oh, eight for years. You be looking Before like, you even get damn, why the, the fuck this shit ain't black you, man. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, okay, brother had to see me like, yeah, man, you can't be doing that. Yeah, I'm like, man, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna chill like, so I be chilling. Y'all can fuck with me, dog. I've been up a cool dude. You know what I'm saying? I ain't worried about nobody. So it's all about growth, man. Yeah, yeah. we were growing, man. We was young, man. That yeah. shit. Yeah, you feel me? We was on a whole nother tight time right now. We ain't no bullshit. You feel me? We on some whole other shit. We trying to get the most money we can before we got down 50. You feel me? Not for real. So, shit. Especially when 
Nigga had the nigga that was in the video with me in jail doing crazy numbers. Like, you're like, yeah, nigga, gotta learn how to sit down, man. They put, throw your ass away. Or you get murked out here, man. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. nigga just out here trying to get rich on these people, you know what I'm saying? Rich and take a nigga, bitch. That's about it. <laughs> Let's talk about some of these new songs you guys got out. We'll start with uh, Time Come with both of y'all, man. Yeah. So yeah. talk about the, you know, the creative process, the inspiration for this one. Brother just hit me up and said, I got a yeah, I just bad hit motherfucker it. out. I say, man, I got a bad motherfucker. I need my brother on the, yeah, you feel me, ASAP. Yeah, soon as I heard way it, be yo. I'm like, bitch, you need to come to the H right now, nigga. <laughs> you feel me? Yeah, I Come on, man. Like, you feel me? He it ain't bad rule that raggedy. What's up? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? They see me around that motherfucker. Yeah, we dropped it out. That was just sounded like it was one of the ones. So we mm. just shoot that video ASAP. Linked up with Cass Jones. Cass Jones the fool. You know what I'm saying? Linked up with him. He came to Bowman. Um, to the trenches, too. Made it happen. Nah, made for it happen. Real. What's that chemistry like when you guys are cooking up together then? Like, goddamn. I don't know if you was to able to see Larry Bird and goddamn Magic Johnson play on side each other or goddamn <laughs> Some LeBron. Dream team you feel me? It's just, you know it's a saying. force you can't, you feel me? You can't fuck with. LeBron and Kobe. Right. You know what I'm saying? Sit you ain't never seen yeah. before. On some, on some new pimp and bun type shit yeah. times 10, though. Yeah. I heard the pimp like, and bun. <laughs> the new you feel me? Times 10. We got so much shit together, though. It's like, that shit natural with us, too, though. Yeah, because we started together, so it's like, I was with him when he found his song. He was with me when I found my song. So it's like, he know what to put me on. I know what to put him on. Nah, I know what beat he gonna fuck with. He know what beat I'm gonna fuck with. Yeah, so that shit Sometimes natural. Sometimes a nigga might be high and just put on some shit and we just, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> That's kind of both out of our bullshit, yeah. you know? That be the song that damn that be. Yeah, when you experiment, man, yeah, that'll be the be ones, the ones, man. Like, man kind of get you out like your comfort zone a little bit. This nigga stay telling me the ones I don't like. Nah, that's the one. Y'all yeah. put that one out. I'm like, damn, this bitch go 10 times harder than me. I've been jamming this one there and since I recorded it. Yeah, that'd be the <laughs> ones, know. man, for real. Yeah, they say you can't pick your hits. You, you know, like the fans them. are going to pick them for you. Yeah, they definitely going to pick them for you. It's going to be the one you least expect. Until like. we get to that point where we can pick. Yeah. I mean, we're gonna just put out what we want to put out. Like, they gonna like everything. Yeah. That's what I'm on. They gonna like everything. They ain't gonna see it. I'm some young it. boy shit. Young boy fans don't give a damn what he put out. It could be a whole <laughs> album full of. Yeah. You feel me? Heartbreak over a bit, man. They gonna rock with it. I don't tell you. So, it's like, I'm trying to get like that. Nah, for sure. Uh, talk about this evil grin, uh, Quincy. Oh, yeah, that evil grin just. That's one of them songs like, man, you know, there's a lot of niggas out here that lost their partner and they be wanting to get some give back type shit. Like, shit, you know that man ain't, he damn near mad that if y'all don't get no give back. That's how I be feeling about shit. Like, if a nigga, if I die, these niggas better go get at them people. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm not happy at all, so I feel like, you know what I'm saying? They don't, they don't, man, these niggas don't really love you. A lot of these niggas just, be with niggas and they just be getting capped and niggas gone about their business. They don't even think about the nigga no more. Yeah, even Green, that's that type of vibe. Like, I do this for my, that's for my dead niggas, man. The ones that, they know what's up. Yeah, A lot of niggas hard. know what's going on with us, man. We ain't gonna speak on that, but they know what's going on. That's for my dead niggas, man. E, I really fuck with this Easter Pink, man. You like that Easter Pink? Yeah, that's yeah, simple. I was in my in bag there. on that motherfucker. I ain't gonna lie down the counter though for that. What that was that? <laughs> 48 to be exact. <laughs> it just went in that bitch and went out, full of that wop. Hmm. Caught that bitch Easter Pink, my nigga Swede. Shout out my nigga Swede. Yeah, Swede. Most city the dawn type nigga, for real. That's the nigga that's gonna give you out kind of name. And then kept seeing me. He seen me for like a year straight. When I came to that age, when I moved to that age. Seen me about a year straight. Every day seen me. I was always had a cup. That nigga said, damn, Easter Pink, you done spun down there a hundred. Yeah. You tripping. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, bitch, I know. I'm oh, worried right. about it. Like, it was like, since then, Easter Pink, Easter Pink. So shit, that's where that come from. Yeah. 
And is that where the Mr. Keep a Cup come yeah. from, too? That Mr. Keep the Cup just a it's a Texas thing. Niggas in Texas gonna keep them a cup. Niggas gonna mm -hmm. sip. Like, that's what we do. That's part of our culture. Absolutely. Just like Florida got their own culture. Louisiana got their own culture. In Texas, we we sip all in. You know what I'm saying? We like our music slow. You know what I'm saying? Everything. So, we like fast cars too, though. You know what I'm saying? So, it's like. It's like them slabs too. Slab crazy, riding on foes. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it's a, just a Texas thing. You know, niggas gonna sip. Yeah. So shit, everybody call that shit Mr. Keep. Nigga been sipping forever, for real. Like that shit got cool around the world. We watched it get cool around the world, but we was kids, uncles of them sipping and shit. Like, yeah, for sure. I remember sipping orange. <laughs> Niggas don't even remember. What the hell on? <laughs> be like, niggas don't even know how for a nigga yeah. sipping yeah, orange, orange drink. Really like, was the truth, though, while niggas playing. Yeah, while niggas playing, that orange was really him. That's yeah, what I'm telling you, bro. That niggas, orange I, was I really the back. truth on my mama. Like, that orange was him. When I made that purple, green, and red song, that was about seven years ago. And I was sipping probably way, way before I would have been sipping. How long have you been sipping? Damn, too long. For sure. I know yeah. I probably started you sipping. You know, it's just a like Texas thing. Everybody sipping. Kissed the cup by 12 years cup. old or something. My first time about kissing the cup. And been kissing them bitches ever since. Y'all think y'all ever quit? Put it down? Man, I ain't gonna lie, man. I don't see nothing wrong with you it. You gotta learn how to you gotta drink like, water with it. You, you gotta know? just be healthy, bro. You gotta wake up in the morning and get you a green shake with celery. Nah, you know I'm what I'm saying? They were just what we be getting that shit. celery, that shit. I was cucumber, that, he be, you know what I'm saying? He make me drink it in the morning. Yeah. Like, Cobb and go get that orange drink. I mean, that green drink, you got to have flush it. Flush everything out. Flush it, get you right. You drink that shit, you might feel like P. Diddy. Just Man, see how P. Diddy be just waking up happy, <laughs> dancing and shit. I'm telling you, man, you got to do your Y'all body right, then you shit. can do what you want to do, man. I'd rather drink some water. <laughs> yeah, well, that's man. important, too. Yes, I really know that drink. shit will yeah, be Yeah, that too, though. You too. know, you got to drink water. I just got in the water, though. They had the poison. I didn't caught too many kidney stones sipping this shit. <laughs> <laughs> no, I know that shit painful, man. Man, I had to start drinking some water. Y'all talking about celery. I don't know, man. I let that old shit. They were just talking about this shit last night, too. Talking about green drink. I just ate some lamb chops. I hear them people fuck my mad potatoes up last night. <laughs> it was that spot we went to, bro, last the night. The lamb chops was cool. You know, they put too much green shit on my I shit. I ain't gonna lie, that like, shit was good to me, bro. <laughs> What'd you get? Man, I got the lamb chops with the mashed potatoes. What that was, it was a, um, it Man, was they like put every kind of green on that bitch. Spinach in there, but it was the truth, though. They had the motor in there, too, man. They had all kinds of shit in there. But see, you know what you ain't do? You ain't tell them to put cage, and I told them folks. Man, to I, want, I didn't want no salad on my mashed potatoes. <laughs> no salad. That's everything you need, though. You get what I'm saying? You <laughs> need <laughs> yeah, everything yeah. you need. You got your vegetables, you know what yeah, I'm saying? Cool on that. You know what I'm saying? You just but, want the meat and potatoes, huh? Yeah. <laughs> They want to drink green drinks in the morning and all kinds of shit. These niggas crazy. So what's the next project, guys? What will we be working on right now for the rest of 2023? I ain't gonna lie, I'm just trying to drop these bitches. Yeah, we're trying to get these bitches up, like, man. Shit, I don't sure. want to give them no tape until I know for sure I'm gonna okay. clear 100,000 mil or something. I don't really want to give them a lower body of work. I'd really just play yeah. video, 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 yeah. video. Which is smart because you figure it's easier to get someone to listen to one song, one video, yeah. yeah. than a yeah. full project with ten. One of them motherfuckers gonna be cool to everybody. Everybody gonna say, "Nah, that video yeah. louder than a motherfucker." Yeah. You gotta and get some there you spark go. going. So shit, dropping a whole tape and you just kind of wasting the music. Maybe if they, the wasting the music there. at this so, time. You could have just took your time and shot a video for all the motherfucking songs. So what's the next video? Y'all got something already shot? You got something uh, Yeah, I just shot this shot video. Um, video with um, Tayo. Tayo, my boy Tayo shot this. He um, came to the hood. We threw a block party. Okay. So um, my little nigga Goo, R.I.P. Goo. Um, one, of the, one of my people from the crib, from the hood, died, you know, you know what I'm saying? Sure. One of them hood angels, you feel me? Threw a block party for him, came out there and shot it. Everybody came out. 
So yeah. I really wanted to drop that motherfucker today. Oh, for real? Yes. Yeah, yes. Yeah. So it might be out by the time this Yeah, by the time yeah. I land the more, that motherfucker might okay. drop. I so might, by the time this interview yeah, ends, yeah, this shit so, already out. I might have yeah. to pay that extra on that Wi-Fi for that plane. <laughs> I might drop that bitch in the air, you feel me? <laughs> but so, but yeah, that's what we on. Okay. Video, you know what I'm saying? Network campaigning. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Probably have to come do this run again with you. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Hey, we gotta got keep y'all in the loop, man. For shit, y'all. Yeah. Collab project between y'all two? Or? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Cause yeah. they wanted it's like, and that's just something for you know what I'm saying. The our first fans, mm -hmm. they been. I yeah, got DMs you know every saying. day about this shit, man. Y'all need to drop this, drop this, drop this, drop this. It's coming, brother. It's coming. Just okay. give it some time, man. Yeah, yeah for real. Yeah. Yeah, sooner than later, for shit, y'all. It'll come, because niggas trying to get up though, man, for real. Shoot these videos right now, that's the main goal right now, though. Nigga, I shoot these videos and get, put some promotion behind them bitches. Yeah. Because niggas ain't promoting themselves, you know what I'm saying? You can put the video out. Right? Got to promote your shit, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, because if you don't promote it, who else going to promote it for you? Who else going to do it, man? So, you yeah, know what I'm saying? Gotta put that bread into it. You got to yeah, invest in it all, so. You put more money in that image than the actual tools the actual that's going to Yeah, you the tools, you nigga. You got to yeah. use them tools for real with that shit. Yeah. You know I put the money in the right spot. No, that's that's what we finding out, figuring out. You feel me? That was, it was a lot of shit that we ain't know. Yeah. Because it wasn't nobody to show us. So we had to really sit down and Google shit and watch videos and, oh, you can do this? Okay, bitch, oh, I need this right Running here. Running to niggas this. like Rob, have a nigga like Rob in your ear. Niggas like him, we should have been at Rob in our ear. <laughs> you know He's someone on your team like that. I yeah, mean, like, man, man, you need a nigga like him, bro. No cap. That's real. Cause we had nothing but shooters and niggas wanted to beat up niggas and them niggas wasn't on that. They just wanted to come to the show and fuck a hoe. <laughs> Just stand on stage. Yeah, you right? know what I'm saying? Somebody <laughs> got to try to get this shit organized, brother, you yeah. know? You got to let them know you got to do the work first. Yeah, somebody got to do So we would have been had that going on. We probably would have been already done do some shit. So, but hey, it's never too late. You know what I'm saying? Everything happened for a reason. Not for real. It'd be taking, take a perfect time. I guess it's the time, though, for shit, so. Yeah. Niggas didn't mature, got off that bullshit. Focus on this music. Trying to take this shit where it need to go. No, you know what I'm saying? So for Bone I can always have the door open once we get in that bitch, cause we gonna leave, we gonna bust that bitch open and keep it open. We ain't gonna close it on y'all, man. You know what I'm saying? We open that bitch and keep it open. Out, man, cause it's too many bad bitches out there. It's too much money too in this many, shit, you know what I'm saying? Too many baddies. Yeah, the money gonna come, we gonna get the money. We go out. Man, they got them fine motherfuckers I'm trying to run into, my boy. Texas is known for that shit, man. man. Texas cool, but God damn. Trying to go, you feel me? I need some. You feel me? You want to hear every state, too. Exactly, you know what I'm saying? It's all time, yeah. man. Got to have you one in every state. I don't know if I want Jada Wade or Ruby Rose. <laughs> That's what that nigga said. Tyler, yeah. You know what I'm saying? my mama. I'm trying to come out with something new. So when I pop it, whoever popping at that time, I'm coming for it, they gonna know I'm coming. That might be a shit show. Right. By the time we getting there, all little ones that's out there right now gonna be tampered with. <laughs> <laughs> so when I do pop, whatever year that is, whoever pop that year, I bet they be. That's how I'm coming for a shit show. Cause they all fine to me. <laughs> yeah, <for> shit show. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They all look good. All right, guys, go ahead and plug your social media and give any shout outs you'd like to give before we wrap it up here, too, guys. Yeah. Shout out to the, the whole fucking boat, my man, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to my niggas in the H, y'all know y'all is. You know what I'm saying? Follow me on the gram, Quincy Black underscore 1517. You know what I'm saying? You know, man, I just want to shout out all my boys back home, man, you know. How we banging and how we coming, yes, man. Yes, sir. Follow me, E by the E B O D I. I ain't gonna cap that really only social I'm fucking with because I think everything else to feed. <laughs> so yeah, that's all I'm really fucking with. Boy, even I just yeah. sleep bad time to sleep bad. <laughs> they watching all yeah, that shit. Yeah, to feed, man. Yeah, we out the push, man, with this shit, man. 
really been off the porch, for real, like I said earlier. When we was off the porch, when y'all got off the porch, we was across the street. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Waiting for him to jump off. <laughs> you know, waiting for y'all to jump off, but we didn't jump off the porch, man. In that ATL, man. Big South Side shit, man. Y'all tap in. No corona telling me what niggas said.